<laughs> McMillan, phone. I bet it's the mayor to give us a pat on the back. Said she's your mother. I mean, my grandmother. She said mother. No, my mom's dead. All right, then there's a ghost online too. <laughs> I bring you special cannolis prepared by my wife. This is a nice thing you do for me. <laughs> Brother Dan. How you doing? And who's this fine young man you got with you? This is my nephew, Wes. He's been dying to meet the punching preacher. I'm really looking forward to church this Sunday, punching preacher. That's the first time he's ever said that, Pastor. <laughs> Melanie, your trial period is over. Oh, and I'm hired? Oh, it rhymes with hired. <laughs> it's a water gun, right? Leave the gun. Take the cannolis. <laughs> This is my sister's son. And I gotta raise him right for the next three to five years. Depending on her behavior. And, and hey, uh, if your shift is over, why don't you join us? No, I wouldn't want to interrupt your romantic dinner. I've been managing this restaurant for 15 years and no one's ever asked me to join them before. Thank you. And my answer is yes. Wait a minute. Where's that bottle of Chateau Margot I put aside? Oh, well, I gave it away. But it was to save a man's marriage. I wish I could fire you again. <laughs> See you tonight, Karma. You got it, Dirty Larry. You have to quit your job. I think it's so groovy now that people are finally getting together. I think it's wonderful now that people are finally getting together. I think it's so groovy now that people are finally getting together. I do need to get home tonight. <laughs>